A pot belly pig appeared outside of an elementary school in Putnam County. No one knows where she came from, but now she's got a new pin to lay her head in. Our chief photographer, Nick Marone, introduces us to Wanda. She'll come hang out by the chicken coop and the rabbit coop. In rural Palatka, the calm fields of Landstock is not an uncommon sight. Oh, great. Wanda's going to come visit again. But early this week, so she's been here since Monday. A four legged stranger and she's just hanging out. has found a new home. She's right here. Off of St. John's Avenue Road, kids throwing the old pigskin isn't the only thing going on at the Children's Reading Center Charter School Playground. We have Wanda. Meet Wanda. She showed up the beginning of this week and has been hanging out. This pot belly pig has been a new mascot for the school. She's not aggressive. She just, I guess, likes the noise, likes the attention. But don't call her large. <laughs> Wanda is a very healthy potbelly pig. She's a little chunky. <laughs> this pig may not be as active as the students at recess. She's on lay down. Spending most of the time belly down in the shade. She's in the shade and she is aerating our grounds really well too. But she has quickly became a new favorite guest. The kids love seeing her. We're looking for Wanda every time we come out for recess or PE. Putnam County Sheriff's Office believes Wanda has been abandoned. She's been out for a while. Both the school and the Sheriff's Office shared these photos on social media, hoping to return Wanda to her rightful owner with no luck. We would like to find out where she came from because she's somebody's pet somewhere. But after a short stay at the school, Wanda loves it here and she's here every single day, all day. Putnam County Sheriff's Office was able to catch Wanda and find her a new home. They like her, but I don't think we're allowed to keep her. Leaving the students and the staff at the school a little heartbreaking without her. The kids are going to be sad to see her go. In Palatka, Chief Photographer Nick Marone, First Coast News, on your side.